Natalie Jessup, this is the email that workers at this insurance company got alerting them to watch out for two potentially aggressive hawks right here. Tonight we spotted one of those hawks and watched as she soared from one tree to another here on Mayfair Road. Hi, on top of the conifers in the middle of a very busy commercial district, we spotted one of Tosa's newest, most wanted that has created quite a stir. When I pulled in the office this morning, there was on the perch this massive bird that almost looked like a bald eagle. And it was like, what is that? Red-tailed hawks are common throughout North America. They're not typically aggressive toward humans unless they're protecting their young. Like small songbirds, um, robins, right, that nest on people's porches, you know, will dive bomb the humans as the humans are leaving their front door. Um, so it's essentially kind of the same behavior. USDA Wildlife Services got involved after the bird reportedly dive bombed people at Research Park, landing on them and pecking them, leaving considerable injuries. That same bird is possibly now trying to move in right across the street. Just be very cognizant of where she is. She's a wild bird. She is establishing a territory and you know, trying to build a nest. And For now, the hawks have been staying high above ground in this busy area, giving workers below a sense of calm. I think right now everyone is feeling a little humorous about it, and hopefully no one actually gets injured and can just be a funny joke for us. While the hawk we saw out here didn't bother us or anyone else in this parking lot, aviary experts say that if a nest is established, at that point the bird could become protective and aggressive, and so at that time, a helmet, a hat, a box, even an umbrella could help. Reporting in Wauwatosa, I'm Michelle Fiore, CBS 58 News.